Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make beautiful and complex shapes like lace pattern easier in ZBrush. I'll get to the point. The key is using the path from Illustrator and make it 3-dimensional. I downloaded lace patterns from Adobe Stock this time. I'm not going to explain how to use Illustrator today, but rather just focus on the pattern. When you click Save As, you choose the file format as SVG. You keep the option as it is. Go to Z Plugin and then Text 3D. Click SVG. You see your folder and open the file you just saved. Now the loading is completed and it is three-dimensional. You open the file just a level of extract and change the thickness of a SVG at this time. Today I'm going to use Matchmaker Brush and change the back of the lace pattern along the spherical object. The key of using Matchmaker is that make the size of the brush bigger and move the brush from the top to the bottom one long stroke at a time. By using Deformer, you can deform it more interestingly. After that, I'm not doing anything special. I duplicated it and replaced it. I repeated this manually. You can use it for jewelries, lampshades, illustration, and sculpture. For those of you who mainly use Illustrator, doesn't it seem easier to make a 3D object than you expected? It's good for adding more detail to your artwork, and it can be used in various industries. Next time, I'm going to upload a video of using it in a different way.
On a side note, this SVG2 text 3D can be used on ZBrush Core as well. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up, and leave your comments down below. See you next time.